by and large, vagus is big nerve for the external ear. Well, what else does vagus do? Digestive system, anybody? From its presence on the ear, the vagus next presence is at the, in the mouth, in the soft tissue in the back of the mouth, up there in the soft palate area in the back of the mouth, near where your gag reflex is located. Okay? Your body doesn't want something, you gag. All right, that's the vagus. It's saying, ick, we don't want that stuff in here. And then vagus influences swallowing. It's your main gastrointestinal nerve all the way down. So swallowing and the voice box. I have helped people with forearm issues and voice issues by working the vagus here because vagus influences the voice. Vagus influences swallowing. It influences acid reflux. It can have a profound influence, quieting the vagus can have a profound influence on acid reflux or heartburn and also affect digestion in the stomach. Beyond the stomach, vagus is a main controller in the small intestines and it goes so far as to affect the, and enervate the right side of the colon, the large intestine. And on its path down here, it touches on the heart and it touches on the lungs. It's the parasympathetic controller. It's trying to keep the whole body calm and peaceful and working harmoniously together. So when the vagus gets ramped up and irritated and becomes one of those facilitated nerves, it's like a two-year-old with a bad, bad temper tantrum. Then you've got a whole lot of other things down through the body that can be not happy, that can be dysfunctional and creating a number of different kinds of problems in the body systems.